Hello everyone, wanted to do a little build update. I've done some other aviation videos while I was traveling, but now that I'm back home, I'm back to the build, working on the right wing. And uh, as you can see here, I have the, the ribs uh, all allodyned and prepped and uh, assembled with all the little pieces, uh, the brackets and the, the, uh, the strengtheners and all the stiffeners. So anyway, um, all that's ready and I'm missing some parts, um, some doubler plates and a few other things that go on the spars. So what I'm probably going to do is pack all this up, put it in a box, and then I'm going to pull the left wing parts and get them to the same point that I am with all of these. So uh, anyway, um, made some progress for the little bit that I've been home and not traveling for work and all. So that was kind of nice. I'm also going to add to the back of this. Um, this was a tool that I don't even remember. Somebody recommended it. And let me see if I can zoom in here. Uh, it's actually a tool made for RV-12 aircraft tool supply. I'll do a little video that shows using it. It's kind of interesting. I had to use it for, uh, I think it was this one. Um, yeah, it was rib 10, rib 11. Um, so anyway, uh, I'll add a little clip of me using it. And also my new rivet gun, love it. It's awesome. Uh, you can't go wrong with this one. We'll, uh, we'll look and see how the long-term durability is, but in the short run, it's been fantastic. So nice, uh, nice progress report on that. Uh, although not exactly hundreds of rivets here, but a lot of big rivets, a lot of the 4.8. So anyway, that's it for today. Have a good one. Okay, I wanted to uh, show another instance where this little tool uh, is helpful. Uh, so, in this, this is a uh, rib eleven. Uh, if you can see this, there the rivet is very tight up against this support, and I probably should have riveted these first but if you're in the same situation I am where you already put it in and your rivet gun just it it won't go down because the the nose of the rivet gun is uh, is too large so if you use this little tool um, you can put it on the rivet and it and it does a couple of things it uh, it lifts it up so that the nose doesn't have to go down as far but it also can cant the rivet over just a little bit. So you're, it's gonna get loud with the air, but I'll just sort of demonstrate that it works well. And there we go. Uh, good rivet, seated well. I did the same thing for this one. Uh, worked well, we're all good.